Hey, you guys have been real happy the last few days, right? That that nice bouncing win. Uh, URI coming on strong. Okay, I got another one that's beaten down for you. American Rail Industries. The symbol is A R I I. I've talked about this a lot. I've made money in it most of the time. I did get waxed in it once. Okay, here's the thing. That last, you see that 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 move down. Okay, last time they reported. Uh, <clears throat> It was, I don't know, the quarter was just bad. I mean, externally, their manufacturing business, which is the bulk of their business, was down 25%. Now, internally, they build and sell themselves a lot of cars that they lease out later. Didn't fool Wall Street. The stock got absolutely decimated. However, the mix was bad, too. They had these hopper cars, which uh, are the average selling price is much less than tankers. But we do know Keystone's not going to be built for a long time. We do know that even though oil is cheap, that business probably will come back online. In the meantime, we've seen some signs from some of these rail companies that other parts of the economy may pick up the slack. So I just think it's oversold. I love the action on it today. Uh, breaks out through 55. That's the 50-day moving average on exponential. I think by the end of this year, this could be a $65 stock. So far, it's not for the faint of heart, but I like it for traders and long-term investors. What do you think about this one, Matt? I like it. Three reasons. One, American Association of Railroads, December, traffic up 9%. That's good. CSX, a big rail company, came out. They said things were fantastic. I mean, when they said they're gonna be, their uh, workforce is going up 4%, they're adding more cars. They're going to them. Finally, not one buy rating on this stock. Six holes, Love two it. when it performs. That's Love it. Love when Wall hard. Street hates a yep. stock. Guess what? You got to go from sale to buy, right? <laughs> what do you think? He Manufacturing does? economy is expected to pick up in 2015. Uh, we're watching these numbers like crazy, but I think if that ends up picking up, then the stock will have a bump up as well. Well, listen, cheap natural gas should help. Uh, I'm, the strong dollar kind of balances that a little bit, but also I think American-made products, people around the world still love that stuff. But here at home, the rails, I think, have been oversold. I don't know. You like this one? I'm going to take a pass on it, even though this is a great American company based in Missouri, billion dollar market cap. It's you called American Rail. I mean, how you get can it, you go <laughs> that? You get a 3% dividend, yeah. and that's true. But I am worried about some of these ancillary businesses where there was some over manufacturing and over development, you know, for the shale industry. And, and I want to see, I want to see energy play itself out, find a bottom, then where I think we're going to. So you don't think, that. you're not comfortable with the bottoming process mm -hmm. we're seeing in oil yet? Not, no, not okay. right now. No, I like the tailwinds for the industry. I also think specifically uh, these guys have expanded their leasing business where they're getting a lot of their margins. They also have a number of joint ventures where they're actually getting involved with companies that are making the axles and some of the products that actually feed into this, uh, in, into the car. So, no, I, I like it a lot. You see, Jim did his work, okay? That's the difference here, Hillary. Jim did the work and you didn't. That's all I'm saying. All right, thanks a lot, guys. Hey.